Hello my dear students, welcome to Chemistry Mirrors. The question now appearing on your screen is exercise question 4.29. The question is the time required for 10% completion of a first order reaction at 298 Kelvin is equal to that required for its 25% completion at 308 Kelvin. If the value of A is 4 into 10 to the power 10, second inverse, then calculate A at 318 Kelvin and EA. So, question may have 10% completion ke liye jo time required at first order reaction ke liye, wo 25% completion ke liye required time ke equal hai at 308 Kelvin. Value of A given hai, hume activation energy find karna hai or rate constant at 318 Kelvin. Let's start solving this solution to exercise question 4.29. First, we will write given data. So, given data is A equal to 4 into 10 raised to the power 10. Second inverse T1 is 298 Kelvin, T2 is 308 Kelvin. We have to find EA activation energy and K at T18 Kelvin. Now we are given Time required for ten percent completion at two ninety eight Kelvin. That is T one equal to time required. for 25% completion at 2308 Kelvin. So, for first order reaction, for first order Reaction T is equal to two point three zero three upon K log R naught upon R, where R naught is initial concentration of reactant and R is final concentration of Reaction. Now let us suppose rate constant K one at two nine eight Kelvin. And K2 at 308 Kelvin. So, as the time required is equal, we can write T1 is equal to T2, and value of T1 will be 2. Point three zero three upon K one log R naught upon zero point nine R naught. As the reaction is ten percent complete, so the remaining concentration of reactant will be zero point nine R naught equal to two point three zero three upon K 
टू लॉक आर नो अपॉन जीरो पॉइंट सेवन फाइव आर नो तो इन द सेकेंड केस द रिएक्शन इज ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट कंप्लीट तो द रिमेनिंग कंसेंट्रेशन विल बी जीरो पॉइंट सेवन फाइव आर नो Now from here we can cancel this two point three zero three R naught R naught and here also. So we'll get K two upon K one equal log hundred upon seventy five divided by log ten upon nine. On solving this, K two upon K one will come as two point seven. Now, again for first order reaction, for first order reaction. Log K two upon K one equal to K A upon two point three zero three R one upon K one minus one upon K two. Now let's put the values. Log K two upon K one is two point seven three. Log two point seven three equal to E A. We have to find two point three zero three into eight point three one four into one upon T one is two nine eight seven minus one upon T two is three zero eight seven. Now from here, E A we find that log two point seven three into two point three zero three into eight point three one four into two nine eight into three zero eight upon this three zero eight minus two nine eight that is ten. On calculating this, E A will come as seven six six two two point six nine joule per mole. So this will be the activation energy E A. Now rate constant at three one eight Kelvin. Rate constant. At three one eight Kelvin, if K is equal to K e to the power minus E A upon R T, and this can be written as log K equal to log A minus E A upon Two point three zero three R T. Now let's put the values. Log K equal to log A, and A is four into ten to the power ten minus E A. We are getting seven six six two two point six nine upon two point. Three zero three into eight point three one four into three one eight. From here, on solving this, log k equal to will be getting minus one point nine eight two two. Now anti log. Taking 
एंटीलॉक और टेकिंग एंटीलॉक द वैल्यू ऑफ के विल कम एज वन पॉइंट जीरो फोर इंटू टेन टू दावर माइनस टू सेकेंड इनवर्स तो दिस विल बी द रेट कॉन्स्टेंट एट थ्री वन एट कैलरी 